Hello people of the internet. My name is Yorban and Forty Five and welcome back to Skyrim. AKA the Elder welcome back to the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Special Edition. In the last episode we escaped from Helgen with the help of an Imperial known as Hadvar. Well imp and now we are about to venture into Skyrim, and it turns out we may have to go back there. So, oh. okay. It looks like we may or may not have to. Hold on. Let me probably press continue. I think I accidentally not saved my game when I closed it. Mods are currently loaded. Yes, as you may know, I have downloaded mods. This is one of them. <laughs> I just downloaded this because someone said it was really fast. So if it's truth, then uh, I'll believe them. But it looks like it's still froze. <laughs> So, whoever said that it should be instantaneous, you kind of lied. I think. Yeah, I can't really do anything. Literally, it's just frozen. This is going to take a quite a long time. Because here's the thing, though. Because I downloaded, like, so... Today, I've downloaded so many mods. Like, I downloaded one too many mods. So, I feel like just for the next few episodes, I'm going to not... Oh, here we go. For the next few episodes, I'm not going to download oh yeah this is also one of the part this is part of the mods um so as you just saw there it actually registers six new mods well a few new mods i got the apocalypse spells mod better vampires mod deadly dragons mod enhanced blood ordinator perks sacred vampires and sky ui and if you don't know what sky ui is it's this so now instead of looking like that old one we just saw last episode it's now this which means it should make a little life a little bit more easier for me. So anyway, we're gonna walk with Hadvar to uh, to a place called Riverwood. Ah, which is like it's loaded below other mods. Okay, I'm gonna have to fix that. Uh, okay, this is gonna be glitchy as hell. Oh yeah, it's also registering other mods. So like, if we go to the mod configuration, we've got uh, still the same mods, I think. But yeah, um. Yeah, if there's gonna be any bugs, I'm. I should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. We could really use someone like you. Oh, there we go. I've also downloaded most of Citizen. The themselves a dragon. General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. I don't think General Tullius would do craft. So join the Imperial Legion. Now. Now I might download a mod because if you don't know, but. In, here's like the uh, lore about um, the Imperials. The Imperials and the Stormcloaks are at war. See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. When I was a boy, that place always used to give me nightmares. Draugr creeping down the mountain to climb through my window at night. That kind of thing. I admit, I still don't much like the look of it. Draugrs. If you don't know what Draugrs are, Draugrs are like undead menaces. Like, I, I pl again, I've played this game like a few times before, so I know what it happens. Um, all right, Mage Stone, These Warrior the Stone, stones. or three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead, see for yourself. I'm going to accept the sign of this. Warrior, good. I knew you shouldn't have been on that cult the minute I laid eyes on you. What do you expect? Actually, I've got a <laughs> I was gonna pull out two swords, but I don't actually have a sword. I actually have a. Oh, wait, now I don't even know which button. Is... Oh, there we go. It's R. Yeah. Cool. But yeah, if you yes. don't know. As far as I'm concerned, you've already earned your palm. But until we get that confirmed by General Tullius, just stay clear of other Imperial soldiers and avoid any complications, alright? No. But, but yeah, if you don't know, the, the armor that Hadvar is now wearing, this is part of the Immersive Armors mod. Basically, the Imperial Legion has now has a new look. So, since he's like got like a rank in the Imperials, um, in the Imperial Army. Um, I'm glad you decided to come with me. Almost to Riverwood. Riverwood. I'm gonna re-equip my two swords, because, you know, I like having two swords. Like, 
If you don't know, but I actually have a preference for dual wielding, not um. Yeah, I have a preference for dual wielding. So if anyone has a different opinion, uh, I can handle your opinion on uh, you know. Well, I said I would have a. I thought I said I would have a break from the Gwamet community for a bit, but you know. It still doesn't stop. Me. I'm still trying. I'm still used to my Gwamet antics. All right. Sven. All right. This woman's gonna complain about something. Uncle Halvor, hello. Pat, what are you doing? Are you on leave from shores to boats? What happened to you, boy? Are you in some Uncle, kind please. of trouble? Keep your voice down. I'm fine, but we should go inside to talk. What's going on? And who's this? He's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. Come on, I'll explain everything, but we need to go inside. Okay, okay, come inside then. Sigrid will get you something to eat, and you can tell me all about it. A dragon. A dragon. There you go. What? What is it, what is it now, mother? Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm gonna turn on subtitles just so that if anyone wants to like know what they're saying, just in case you know, uh, my game's being stupid or something. Um, I'm gonna buy like subtitles and general subtitles. Night. It, it flew right over the barrel. Dragons now, is it? Please, mother. If you keep on like this, everyone in town will think you're crazy. <laughs> and I've got better things to do than listen to more of your fantasies. You'll see. It was a dragon. It'll kill us all, and then you'll believe me. <laughs> oh my god. Women. I mean, old ladies and their beliefs. Am I right? Just in respect to old people, I do not mean that in like the, uh, the I do not mean it in the meanest way possible. Secret. We have company. Hadvar, we've been so worried about you. Come, you two must be hungry. Sit down and I'll get you something to eat. Now then, boy. What's the big mystery? What are you doing here looking like you lost an argument with a cave bear? I don't know where to stop. You know I was assigned to General Tully as a skull. We will stop the net. Okay, I'm just gonna turn up my uh, audio, so... Just... I'm gonna turn up the voice, because, you know... When we were attacked by a dragon. A dragon? That's ridiculous. You aren't drunk, are you, boy? Husband, let him tell his story. Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. Mass confusion. I don't know if anyone else got out alive. I doubt I'd made it out myself if not for my friend here. I need to get back to Solitude and let them know what's happened. I thought you could help us out. Food, supplies, a place to stay. Of course. Any friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. I'm glad to help however I can. Like I said, I'm glad. But I need your help. We need your help. Oh, we can actually select some things we could use. Um, I'm gonna use... I'm gonna need some healing potions. I'm not, I won't need any, like, iron ingots or something. So, yeah, I'm that basically all I'm going to Yaro for. needs to know there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. You know, fun fact, a Jarl is actually like equivalent to a mayor of a city, except it's more like hered hered like more of heritage than, um, you know. Good day. Ah, did you really see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? Hey, okay, Alfred's gonna go back to his old antics. Now, I heard you can get a follow, like an early follower here, so I'm gonna re explore Riverwood because I'm gonna find this elf guy. Because I've actually acquired this elf like a few times in my past Skyrim games. This guy must have been mad at me for not saving his son. 
if you don't know, but if you actually go for the storm cloak, the rebel, you actually get, you actually end up in a, in a log mill and not the blacksmith. But the blacksmith is obviously preferable. It's nice to be back in a friendly spot, huh? Yeah, it is. <laughs> Listen, I'm going to lay up here for a while. You can make your own way to solitude from here. I'd recommend heading to White Pine, just down the road from here. From there, you can take a carriage to solitude. Got it. But yeah, I feel like for now, Hadvar is going to be the Imperial Guard, just like sitting around doing nothing. No, I'm gonna go. Oh, pfft, no, no, I'm not gonna be arrested by Hadvar for lockpicking a house. If I do that, obviously I just did that like right in public. Um, mm -hmm. Sleeping giant. That's where you. I think that's where you can find the elf. I think I could be wrong. Um, Orgnar. Orgnar. Are you listening? Hard not to. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. Alright, um... Did you hear me? Not in the yeah, yeah. Ale's going bad. <laughs> yeah, those two complain. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. Need a room? Talk to Delphine. Why are you walking outside? Oh yeah, it's because it's beautiful. It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing, flowers are blooming. On days like these, kids like you should be burning in hell. <laughs> oh my god. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. Maybe no you could talk some sense no into my pig-headed brother. No thief. Yeah, well, I don't know what you overheard, but the uh, yeah, an ornament, solid gold. You could. You're not from I've around here. Got some coin there. coming in from my that last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Obviously, that lo that woman is like important for one of the side quest quests, and that's actually a true fact. Now I need to I need to look for the uh, I need to look for the guy. This guy. Did I see you talking to Sven? Maybe not. He's a bar. Thinks his ballads and an intelligent, beautiful woman like her wouldn't fall for that nonsense. I hope. I don't need your joke. Could you? Could you give her this? I'll show you what I know. Mm. I don't have enough gold, unfortunately. Farewell. Alright, so we're gonna like optional tell Sven about Fade Dog Weather. This way. <laughs> Fane Dolph thinks he can win. Those <sighs> you had best tell the Jarl in Whiterun. He needs to know about this. <sighs> what is <laughs> as if here, I had to use simple words, but this letter should convince Camilla it's for me. This way. What are you talking of? Oh my. He, he wanted me to think Fandal wrote this? Thank you for telling me the truth. Could you talk to Fandal as well? I'm sure he'll want to thank you for standing up for him. You're nothing but trouble. Then <laughs> now the dude hates me. Note to self. If you, note to self. Although, by the way, don't ever snitch in real life, people, unless you really, unless you know, get serious or whatever. I, I'm gonna say, I'm just gonna get myself a hate face. In real life, just be careful when you're snitching on people, because uh, you know people will come after you if you do snitch. So. Okay, those two are gonna start bicker. Um. As far as I do know, Fendal, Fendal is, uh, where is Fendal? Now, anyway, I was going to like talk about the backstory about the whole Imperial stuff. So the lore about the Imperial Army is, um, well, I'm going to name this another boring episode of playing Bethesda games. Anyway, um, as I was saying, um, so... Basically, oh, there's Fendal. Um, Fendal, tell me as soon as you've given Camilla the letter. I appreciate your help. Please take this. There we go. Some gold I've saved See, up from working if I help Fendal, he becomes my follower. Lead the way. And when he, if he does become a follower. 
He gets to use. He pulls. Now, when I pull out a weapon, he pulls out his weapon, which is a bow, of course. I've got your back. Although I could use some armor. I'll from show him. you what I know. I did not meant. I need to what take some things here. He's got an iron dagger, a key to his house. Um, he's gonna need some better gear if he's gonna like you know, fight. Oh yeah, I forgot I have a. Lead on. Well, I'll just lead on. <laughs> So yeah, now whenever I go anywhere, now he will fall. Now uh, Fendel is gonna follow me. I kind of like um, Niner and Sunny. By the way, I'm just letting you know this one's gonna be a bit of a different one, as this one's gonna be two Skyrim videos in a row. Because right now, as of now, I just don't feel like playing. Uh, I don't really feel like playing Fallout right now. So second part will be uh, filmed straight after the first one. Because like I can't really make it like a full-on hour because literally it'll just take like two hours for it to like upload. But, you know, life is life. <laughs> what do you expect? But life gives you lemons. Uh, Fallout New Vegas video is probably going to come out tomorrow, so, yeah. Oh, yeah, by the way, if you could. Uh, wolf, 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 die wolf, 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 wolf. Thank you, Fendal. Where are you, Fendal? Where are you, Fendal? Where did that arrow come from? I saw an arrow. Yeah, look, there's an arrow. Fendal is somewhere. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's Fendel. Yeah, I actually set the, uh, like, I, I, I forgot. I actually set a rendering distance, so the game's quality is going to be really low. So I, I feel like if I walk way too far from Fendel, he'll just, like, disappear. Which isn't going to be, uh, which there's nothing I can do about that. Because I don't want my game, I don't want my sky, I do not want this game crashing all the time on me. You don't know, but it, this game usually requires, like, 8 gigs of RAM just to play. And I don't even have 16 gigs of RAM in this computer, in this computer I have. Unless, you know, I can switch out graphics cards. So, for now, you'll, I'm gonna have to stick with using what I have, which is, like, 8 gigs of RAM until, you know, I can really afford. Alright. In is these... Are in your mid, sir, be on your way. I am being on my way, jeez. Is that a Stormcloak? If it is, I'm gonna shoot him. Oh, yeah. Um, there's also another quest line I can do, so... If you guys want, I'll, um... Oh yeah, I don't have Open City Skyrim installed as well, because Open City Skyrim could cause the game to lag. What my- I don't want my game's performance to go too dr drastically low. Like, if I go to, like, if I have an FPS, what do I want with my FPS? Wait. Uh, no, it won't. Um, I think that's in, uh, I think that's- I think that's in it. Listen, there we go. If it is, I'll turn it on next. Huh. Actually, three iron arrows. I don't know who these people are. Jay's obviously gonna like say. Well, that's taken care of. No thanks to you. See? She's gonna say no thanks to you. Well, it's too be honest. I like gaining respect, and despite the fact that was a bit of a glitch, so. So. Don't just stand there. Those are giants. I wanna... That's your so giants are very, are like really big nuisances. Like they're, the giants, and obviously the giants is a very, it's like a bunch of nuisance. Fight with us and you'll have There we go. So now, um. Come up to your Vasker, if you're worth anything in a fight. Okay, so now um, if we talk to her again. You handle yourself well. You could make for a decent shield, brother. An, an order of war. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Not for me to say. The old man's got a good. S if you go to him, good luck. So, companions. Basically, the companions is basically like a bunch of like. Basically, people that tend to follow each other. I might have to change the character. Rendering. Render distance. To a different. All right. After the first part, I'm gonna close the game quickly, reload, and you know, reload my game with the character setting, with the character rendering settings on higher. By Eastmere, it's true. A jester, funny suit and all, just north by the Laurius farm. 
Fool had a coffin in a cart with a broken wheel. I'd like to see him laugh his way out of that. <laughs> <laughs> Well, sounds like you've had quite the journey, Uthka. But you were gone longer than usual. I got to thinking maybe you weren't coming back. You sound like my ma. Figured I was lying dead in the field somewhere, is that it? <laughs> Thought did cross my mind, yeah. War brewing, talk of a riot in Helgen, that Mount Jester's. Skyrim's gone mad, girl. We need to be careful out there. Careful, huh? Thanks, Skullbar. I'll remember that. <laughs> yeah, right. Think you can go blade to blade with me? You'd be dead in six seconds. And why not? A hundred gold says I knock your heart. Why don't you come back when you actually have a hundred gold? Oh yeah, I don't have any gold. Um, Sven, do you have any I'm gold with you? you? I'm right behind you. Tell me if you have any gold. What do you want me to carry? Uh, nope, you don't have any gold. Craft. You lead. I'll oh yeah, you've got also, there's also the ability to marry people in this game. And have children. Like, you can also adopt children in this game, so you can actually start your, like, your own happy family. When I, when I did, when I, when I actually defeated the dragon in, um... When I did the ending of Skyrim before, I actually married, um, one of my followers. Not in real life, but in the game. Uh, one of my companions, and uh, I ended up, you know. Okay, now we'll go. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Riverwood's in danger too. We better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach at the top of the hill. Although I do feel like I should also tell you a true fact. This is this is mod. Okay, it's gonna lag a little. But that's because it's loading up all the buildings and stuff. Okay, please don't crash. Alright. Again, this is gonna be laggy we'll a little. Pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size Grey Mane or Battleborn. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours? Then I say, well great. met, friend. I can tell you were a sharp one the moment I laid eyes on you. What do you expect? I'm wearing Imperial armor here. Imperials for the win. In retrospect, I don't know. I think I might leave a vote either if I join the Rebellion or the Stormcloak. Well so. Met, traveler. So yeah, if anyone, if anyone, if anyone likes, I can just create a poll. Asking people if um, if I should join the Grey Mains, I mean not the Grey Mains, if I should join the Stormcloaks or the Imperials. The Imperial Army is led by General Talius, uh, basically fighting for the Almighty Dominion. But there's a mod where you can actually turn against this whole Almighty Dominion. And if you don't know what the Almighty Dominion is, it's those High Elves that you saw in the beginning of the game. They're basically called the Falmor, and basically the Falmor are basically, you know, they're basically. Hello, friend. In the bows and arrows for the mighty huntsman. Okay, I'm gonna barter with this guy. Um, because I've got some irrelevant crap I don't need. Um, before you ask, no, I am not trying to. I've got, I've got no. I don't really cook in this game. Wait, I don't know. Yes, my after he shot an arrow that pierced an archer. Huh? I've got just what you need. Uh, okay, I've got a hundred gold now. If you don't know, but with a hundred gold, Thank you can you actually like fight someone, and then like, which is earth god. Who are you? Blade and shadow. Oh, Silence. this woman's the mercenary. All right. I, I haven't played this game in quite a while, so I don't remember much of this game. But other than that, that woman, that elf woman, is actually a mercenary. You hire her to become your follower. If it's nope. Come on in. Just All right. stoke the fire. Basically, that's, this that's, is an old I feel like the beginning of my objective is just, drink, is just to try and, uh, you know... Sadia, else, wake up, just, dear. Yes, mum. It's also, um... You want a drink? No. Now, please. There's no a white questions. one guard here. There's a guard here. 
if there's one thing I've learned about this game, it's the fact that we need to wait. So here's the thing, I want to fight Earth Gods because I need enough followers to go through a, um, another level. Because here's the thing, if you get more followers, you basically, you basically, basically more of the enemies will get distracted by them and there'll be a potential good chance for you to kill them from both sides. Think of it as like, um, you want to hear a little Nord wisdom? And why not? A hundred gold says I knock your hide. Just fists. No weapons, no magic, no crime. Down Let's go. Frick, the killer oh. of Come kings. on. The Thought I heard something. Death, we will drink. Ah, 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 ah. Do fight, your work. Fight. Yeah. Ah. Someone do something. Ah. This is a low. Ah. 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 Ragnar the Red. Ah. This is a local favorite. Ah. Come on. I can do much better than that. Hiya, hiya, hiya! Hiya, 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 ha, ha! I guess they. I the wonder they don't even call you a good. Wow. That's what I call a punch. You got me. And they call you Earthgirt the Unbroken. You're no liar. Best fight I've had in years. There you are. Honestly, if there's an Undying the Undying mod, I would definitely download it. Um. You're someone who can get. Let's not waste any time. Yeah, see, I can actually hire her to be my uh, my assistant. And now, I've got two followers. I've got um, still I've got here. an elf, and Let's I've got going. I'm still here. I've got a Nord. I think that's what she is. I think she's a Nord. Um. Let's go. Okay, put our guns. Oh, did I say guns? I meant to say put our swords away. Mm. What that? He went. Mm. Mm. Richer. Mm. Foolish old woman. You know. He say Helgen got hit by nothing of ours. All right, let's go meet the suffering. king. Because you know. God save a gracious king. Okay, I'm not gonna sing it because <laughs> why? <laughs> not because I was not because of like you know I'm not this I'm not disrespect I'm not disrespecting any country or nationality. It's just why am I being a bit political in this matter? Like poli this is basically the game's politics right here. Oh yeah, by the way, in case of people wondering why I'm using the Dover key and not like. Oh, the dra that's supposed to be Dragonborn. I'm the commander of the guard here in White Run. Like, I I'm, I just said it's a Dragonborn because you know memes. You yeah, I'm gonna set the render distance for a bit higher. I only oh, nice sword. What's the meaning of this interruption? Jarl Balgruff is not receiving visitors. This is no time for rash action. Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Come on then, the Jarl will want to speak to you personally. Who's this then? So you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? Mm. Really? You're certainly forthright about your criminal past. But it's none of my concern who the Imperials want to execute. Especially now. What I want to know is, what exactly happened at Helgen? I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this... What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls? Against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains... The Jarl of Falkreath will view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not... I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yo, Balgruff the Greater. Yes, my yarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. Uh, well, here. Take this as a... There is a... Come, let's go find Faringar. Faringar. <laughs> Alright, so now we... Now, now I can equip... The, uh, now I can just equip this stuff. My court wizard. 
<laughs> Damn, I'm looking good. I look poggers. Um, Still here. Yeah, Fendal, you're gonna need new clothes. What do you want me to carry? I want you to carry. Uh... Why do I have two light imperial armor? And these spur gauntlets, because why not? And this helmet. One of those makes it even look more funnier. Faringar, I think I found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you... Yes, I could use... Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a day. Straight to the point, eh? I, uh, learned of a certain stoke. Go to Bleak Falls Vera. Find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. All right, let's see what, what, what he has for say. Let's actually see guests. what he has for sale before uh, you know I end this. Oh, jeez, he's got a lot of spells. Um, all right, dragon's teeth, um, drop zone, um. <sighs> The fact is, it looks like this is some of the stuff I don't really need, like Crackle, um, Dispel Magic, Dispels all magic effects it except the seizures on friends and foes, um, Thea, Oofly, um, actually, I'm an Imperial, so basically, my powers is the voice of the Emperor. Priority now. Anything we can use to fight this dragon, or dragons, we need it quickly, before it's too late. Of course, Yao Valhoof. You seem to have Balhoof. found me an able assistant. I'm sure he will. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna steal anything from a king. Succeed at this. It would be treason. Be rewarded. White run will be in your debt. Hmm. All right. All right. Let's head. Let's head straight to Bleak Falls Barrow. Not the fact I'm playing like Fallout and uh, Skyrim with a keyboard and mouse. I'm usually like used to like using a, an Xbox controller, so I might actually play it with that next episode. Anyway, I think this is gonna be it for. Uh, I think this is gonna be it for the first part of the two, two part special of Skyrim, or probably just for today's episode. This is probably gonna be the once again another boring episode. Um. Thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the second part after I fix some configurations with rendering and all that. Or maybe tomorrow if I'm playing Skyrim again. Uh, goodbye.